quick update here on the mission in the Philippines. It is day 11. I'm beginning to settle in. Definitely feels like longer than 11 days. It's been very busy, very full of travel, uh, planning, preparation, video editing, visiting, and uh, just getting to know this area. I posted a video of the orphanage that I visited, Precious Heritage Children's Home. Uh, I hope that you get a chance to look at that if you haven't already. It was a beautiful place, such a well-rounded program for these children. Uh, they built a school that's a private school that also not only teaches their children, that's accredited, but also the community around them. So it's another way for them to sustain their orphanage and provide for the children. Very cool, very cool program. Ran by a husband and a wife, and the husband's an accountant, the wife is a social worker. So they're just a great team together and they thought of everything for these kids on top of all the love that they gave them. So they have a web page, hopefully you guys can go to that, give generously, and if you're looking to adopt, this is definitely a place to consider. So uh, just, I'm excited to, to visit more orphanages coming up. To, I'll actually be going to one tomorrow. So um, as far as my knee, I posted a video that I was in a, a motorcycle accident about a block from the house after that orphanage visit. Crazy how you can do a five hour round trip travel through insane traffic. They kind of reminded me a little bit of Mad Max at times. Um, some of those scenes where they're driving to the desert. making a block from the house and end up getting in an accident. Um, but that's kind of the way things go sometimes. So yesterday with the knee was not in good shape. It was swollen up, really unstable, had a difficult time walking and standing. So I was about to make the trek to the VA hospital and my contact here, um, my friend suggested that I go instead. And I'm gonna have to read this because it's very difficult to pronounce, but suggested that I go and see a Mangahilat, Mangahilat. Before there was Western medicine in the Philippines, um, Hilats, a Hilat is a healing massage, and that was a common practice for injuries um, in, in the care program. So there's still some of these Mangahilats around. The one that I met, um, her name was Nene Helen, and she was quite a character, talked with me a lot, I didn't understand a word she was saying, we laughed, um, and honestly there's improvement on my knee today. Uh, more mobility, less swelling, and I'm walking a lot better, so I have hope. Um, if a tendon is torn or a ligament is torn, I'm, I know that I'll still have to have an MRI, have it looked at, but it seems to be improving which is which is good news and I'm thankful for that so here's a quick video of me meeting Nana Hay, the manga hilat who gave me a healing massage or a hilat it was pretty cool thanks guys <laughs>